This is the National Radio Talent System. A system of 10-day radio talent institutes across America, discovering and preparing the next generation of broadcasters, and made possible by broadcasters who love the industry and share a vision of the future. All sessions are led by professional broadcasters and each institute in their own areas of expertise. College students, recent graduates, and part-timers apply online to be accepted. Hey, I'm Josh Batson. I'm the production director here at iHeartRadio in Bismarck, North Dakota. I'm also the afternoon drive guy for our active rock station, Rock 101. Hi, my name is Kelly Bradshaw. I'm on the Ken Kelly and Daniel Morning Show on WUSY US 101 in Chattanooga, Tennessee. I'm Tyler Sloan with CNN in Washington. Victoria Rosa, executive producer of the Manny Roy and Lorenz Show on KISS 95.1. I'm now the full-time producer for the Doc, Jeff, and Heather in the Morning Show for Sports Radio WNML in Knoxville, Tennessee, the flagship station for University of Tennessee sports. I'm also the play-by-play announcer for the Knoxville Ice Bears at the Southern Professional Hockey League. Hey there, I'm Joel Gilley, Operations Director with Curtis Media. Hey, my name is Cameron Combs, and I do afternoon drives here at 105.1 The Bull KOMG in Springfield, Missouri. Hi, I'm Brandon Dixon, host of the Triangles News at 3, and an anchor and reporter with the North Carolina News Network, and News Radio 680 WPTF. Jonathan Cruz, nights at 94.7 QDR in Raleigh. Hi, I'm John Wood, afternoon host and music director for 106.9 The Light WMIT in Asheville, North Carolina. I'm from Bradenton, Florida at Pirates Spring Training. Hey, I'm Ashley Wilson with Today's Country, the big 95.7 WKML, and I am fresh back from Vegas in the 51st Annual ACM Awards. I had a great time catching up with some of country music's biggest stars. Radio moved into this 21st century, embracing exciting new technology and opportunity. But even with the technology, ultimately, it's the people that make the difference. All the executives, all the general managers, anyone who's coming in is looking at each and every student sitting in that classroom thinking, what can that person do for my station? The Radio Talent Institute was a once in a lifetime opportunity that I got to be a part of and it's actually where I decided I wanted to do Morning Drive. I love the National Radio Talent Institute. If you're looking to get into broadcasting for any way, shape or form in your career, I highly recommend investing 10 days into this program. If you like me and you eat, sleep, breathe radio, you'll have a blast. I love radio. I still love coming to work every day. Don't just think about it. Actually participate in it. This 10 days could change your life. It could be the difference in you having a job and having a career that you love and desire to do. For students looking to get into this industry, it really can be key to not only networking with people who've not only gone through it, but know where the next steps are going to be. The National Radio Talent Institute, with its notoriety and the experience that I gained within those 10 days, is literally the reason that I have a job right now. I still speak to people that I met back in 2011, and they have helped me tremendously in my professional broadcasting career. You're going to love this program, you're going to meet great people, and you are going to be even more enthusiastic about radio than before you went. It's such a great experience, and it's, it's kind of hard to find the words to talk about it, but just do it. Just do it. These young people are hired today to be the leaders of our industry tomorrow. I know because I was one of those students. Now working professionally in an industry I love. This is the National Radio Talent System.